All right, hello everybody. Welcome to game number one of season 13 of Rebel in G-Man 1. I have probably the best team in Rebel, I think, still. Um, 2,300 TV, 150k in the bank. And it's pretty awesome, isn't it? 14 players, a couple of DP, three strength ups, four claw pom. Um, it's pretty outstanding team, very, very scary. If the dice are remotely even, I think I should absolutely crush Dreamify, <laughs> who has some orcs. He does have a movement 8 1, edge 4, which is pretty nice, and he has got a pommer, but um, he hasn't got a lot. But he has got <laughs> 720 in inducements, <laughs> which is quite a lot, to be fair. To be fair, that's quite a lot. So, but you know, you never know, do you? Anything can happen in a game of Blood Bowl. But, obviously, I think my team is is favoured. Um, especially versus Orcs. With Clawpom versus Orcs is usually bad for Orcs, isn't it? Oh, he's going for a, a Blitzer. And a wizard rather than the four big rather than the three big guys. And he's scumming a bribe! He's a cheater. He's an absolute cheater. Call the Inarian police. <laughs> he's gonna cheat. No, he's not. He's not cheating. Alright. Alright, we'll let him off. We'll let him off for not cheating. <laughs> Hello, Frost Lord Army. Hello, Vulpies and Coulter. And, uh... <laughs> yeah, hello, Jammers and Gammers, yeah. Right, so he's gone for the Blitzer and Troll and Ripper. So he hasn't gone for the three big guys. He, he thought about going three big guys, but didn't. This is probably better, to be honest, getting the wizard. But, you know, maybe he should have just gone for Apples. <laughs> That's always an option, isn't it, in this kind of situation in Rebel, you know. Um, the individual games don't really matter that much. So maybe you'd have been better off just getting some um, apothecaries. They are indeed charming, yeah. It's weird, right, because I think I'm better on defence. And... Uh, and especially with the mum and the wizard. I like kicking with this team. But on the other hand, if I receive it, I'm just absolutely mullering down. He's got 14 players. Hold on, I thought it said Von Hilde. I'm stuck under the bench. The sunglasses are too small for your head, are they? <laughs> yeah. Yes, it is rather irrelevant, but I'm, I want to try to win, you know. Um, I want to try to win. Maybe I'll go like this. <laughs> yeah, 12 and 0. 13 and 0, isn't it? It would be 13 and 0 is the perfect season in Rebel. Um, Hola, that's kind of the opposite of Halo, isn't it? I think if he didn't have the wizard, I would have received and just tried to muller him. I mean, obviously, uh, what happened was, two seasons ago, I had a terrible start because I was just trying to... Um, uh, last season, no, no, two seasons ago, I just tried to conserve my team too much and, you know, really accepted too many draws and lost some and it was horrible and I couldn't, I couldn't catch up at the end. And then the last season, I really tried to win every game from the start and then that was quite good because I was able to, um, 
and was able to take my foot off the gas at the end. So I think I might try that the same as last season and hopefully it will be good. So there you go. <laughs> yeah, I mean 2.3k is, is maybe past the fact of it. Like obviously a 2,300 team is good. It would be worse in a vacuum if it had less skills, but... 2,300 is maybe getting to the point where it's too bloaty, really, realistically, you know. So it, it may not be the most TV-efficient team in Rebel, but it definitely isn't the most TV-efficient team in Rebel. But for sheer power, it's got to be up there, hasn't it? Not that it matters whether it's the best team in Rebel or not. <laughs> At all. <laughs> but I think it is. Again, not that that means anything, or is it any kind of a reward? Well, that's the thing, they only get one wizard, don't they? That's that's why, like, there's, cert there's a certain amount of goodness having a bunch of uh, TV, because they're only getting one wizard. Oh, blots! <laughs> Ça me rappelle la fois où tu as enchaîné tous les techniques de l'ensemble pour en faire une masse vivante. Maybe. Ouais, ça c'était de l'arme de destruction massive. Just gotta try and jam it in, haven't I? Hope for the best. It may well be a bounce out, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> but I mean, I still wanted to do that, didn't I? It wasn't that bad. The commitment there wasn't that wasn't too bad. <laughs> like I had to have it screened in case. I had to protect the down guy. Got claw guys in contact. So bloody losing a reroll. Wasn't the greatest start. Only four claw pom, Papa Piccolo. Hello. Only four claw pom and one claw mighty. Hello, backyard dodo. Hello, backdoor Billy. Yeah, four claw pom. Only four claw pom. I thought blitzing with him was good, seeing as he was the slowest. Obviously, I don't really want him to get in more SPPs, but. He's the slowest one, so. Well, maybe Sean, and he can get lucky though, can't he? Other people have got lucky versus me, so. Um, I don't know. I can tell you. I can tell you on the uh, on Rebel.net. Rebel.net is pretty sweet. Look, history. 
This is season one, two, three, four, five. This is season six for the team. Oh man, if that had been Ripper. Oh, I was so close to being absolutely glorious. Imagine if Ripper had just done a cheeky double skulls. Oh, double skulls, one in nine. Whatever. Yeah, this is season six for the team. Did 814 first season, which is pretty good, in Division 6D. And then, unfortunately, that was too good because I got put in. <laughs> so, finished second. And that was, unfortunately, too good as I got put in, like, the best division in Rebel, as it was, Division 4 in season nine. It was ridiculous. And I finished 11th. <laughs> 427. But then that got me relegated. No, I, I didn't even get relegated. I just stayed in Division 4. Hey! Greed punished! <laughs> yes! <laughs> oh, wow! Oh, mega glorious. And then uh, I finished first, fourth, and first. Right. Wow. He can just hit him. Oh, I know there's a guy in the way. He's got claw as well, though. Get fucked, you little cunt. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> Fuck off. A dodge to hit him with claw. It's kind of, kind of tempting, isn't it? He's just going to stand up. Eh? Oh, he hasn't got guard. Fuck off, man. Get up there. Flap fart. Getting the non spashing done. A vicious stairwell non spashing from Flap fart. I'm totally going to go for this because it's claw mighty, isn't it? I could blit, and then if I use the reroll and the dodge, I can't use the reroll. Hmm. I can't use the reroll. I can't use the reroll. There's two GFIs. Herp derp, base, base, base. This won't fail. I'm on the right. Burp, burp, burp. Again, I can't reroll, otherwise, I'd do a 1D there. But no rerolls allowed. If I hadn't double scored the first turn, I would have gone for that play, I think. Maybe I should have gone, but I really don't want to be on one reroll. Oh yeah, that was the season where I couldn't play the latter half. Yeah, it was. That is true. Yeah, that is true. But I don't think I would have won anyway. Um, right. Sorry, I was trying. I didn't look. I chat on there because I was kind of paying attention. Um, a piling on warrior didn't pile on. I know, right? He had, he had to steal up for his assist. Um, <laughs> to do rocket return. <laughs> Yeah, exactly. Base the base the ball. Um, 
I mean, it would have been nice to have placed the ball. It would have been lovely to have gone for the dodge and the double GFIs to hit him, to be fair. It would have been amazing. But it would have uh, it would have been a disaster if it had gone wrong, wouldn't it? Like, it's really early to be to be using a second reroll. I mean, a third re... Yeah, second reroll. To go down to one. Anyway, oh yeah, so yeah, that, that's a good point on the 427. I did have to concede the last few days it was when I was in hospital. Um, but even if it wasn't, I, it was a really tough season. And then, uh, yeah, then I got relegated. No, I didn't get relegated, didn't get promoted, but you went 10 1 2. And then. Uh, oh, glorious Harringzord. Thank you very much for the raid. A huge raid from Harringzord. Um. <laughs> yes, um, thank you very much. Welcome, Rebel viewers, to a Rebel game. Um, there are there are options. You've got options, Backyard Dodo. Um, I can't recall how you access them. I've got infinite ones, so I can do one. Uh, if you click on them, you've got things like um, modifying emotes and stuff. So, oh wow, he got injured. <laughs> so you can do things like this, like emotes like that, because um <laughs> Yeah, Pedro, yeah. The the donation thing is for if you want to play Mario Kart, I'll buy it. Um if they don't, I won't. So he has run away a bit here, but I can run back. I can run back. Which is nice. Thanks for that. One, two, three, four. Um, so I want to hit him and then blitz the troll, don't I, really? Yeah, I guess so. Views expressed in this stream are not supported <laughs> by the Rebel Admin team. <laughs> <laughs> oh god, that's so good. That's so good. And um, there's a thing down at the bottom for donating. I am trying to not swear so much, yes, to not upset the powers that be. I don't want to sully Rebel's good name with some swearingness. But. I don't want in nine. Oh, you fuck. <laughs> Well, to be fair, I didn't want in nine. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, God. That was really annoying, wasn't it? I mean, I did want the. I was fishing for the power because he's got to stand firm. Maybe I shouldn't have stood him up yet. They're just giving up a hit, isn't it, for no reason. Maybe I should have got him back. One, two, three, four, five. He could have gone back to there first. Or even he could have been the one that went back. They could have both gone back. And I could have just blitzed him. But I like the idea of maybe blitzing the troll. He could have gone back as well. Yeah, I, I, I am trying to... Uh, I do try to swear less doing a, uh, <laughs> when I'm doing the old Rebel. I'm trying. So yeah, this is the best team in Rebel, isn't it? More or less. <laughs> it depends how you define best. I think it is a very powerful team, of course. There's so much TV that people get wizards, everyone gets a wizard against it, which makes it kind of not so good. It's not so TV efficient, but it's very powerful. Yeah, well, that's a thing. A bash team, never mind kill team. But that was the thing that when I, when I said the two best teams in Rebel was when I was playing Devo when his team was unreal, and my team was even, well, it wasn't better than it is now. Mm, kind of, it had four strength four. Now it's got more piling on, but um, it had four strength four, 
And I thought they were the two best teams then, because whether you like Bash or Elves, you would have thought one of those was the best team, if you know what I mean. Whereas uh, now, if you don't like Bash, then yeah, you're not going to like this team, are you, very much? <laughs> Glorious Joseph, well, thank you very much. <laughs> yeah, it's a bit, bit, bit horrible dice for both of us, really, with a blitz and the um. But I've rolled what he's he he greeted into double skulls, and I one in nine into double skulls. He's got an interesting cage here. He's got like space cadet style offense here, hasn't he? I don't really understand. <laughs> he thinks maybe if he'll give me the ball, that I'll uh, I'll roll a one. I guess that's an idea. <laughs> Interesting strategy. Happy New Year! Nice to see BB back. Oh, glorious. Thank you very much. Can't log on. Thanks for staying fantastic for a human and a beaver pregnancy. Absolutely glorious. <laughs> yeah, and maybe that's it. Maybe he just knows I'm going to skull again. Can this guy reach now? That's two for him to get there. And this is two for him to actually hit it. And then he can run around and put tackle zones on the ball. Glorious. Didn't share the sub anniversary, though. Plum. <laughs> Thank you very much. He does know I'm just gonna skull again. That is that is the problem. That is the problem that I'm facing is the fact not the possibility that I might skull, the fact that I will skull. Um it's gonna make this a bit tricky, isn't it? Right. I think he comes round to here. I don't do this block yet. And see if I can make two GFIs. Yeah, I just don't get the ball. Classic. Classic Jim. Oh yeah, I didn't think of that. I didn't think of the score being there. I I remember Rick Reckless not wanting it to cover the dice. Well, the logo thing to cover the dice. I can put it here. Thank you, Hippie. Hippie McKipperson. And that doesn't block the dice. And also doesn't block the score. Brilliant. Well, that was a very disappointment. For fuck's that sake, was... Tony! Stop being shit! That was a, that was a very disappointing... <laughs> Three two dice on the ball. <laughs> oh. Some would say never lucky. <laughs> I think I had to go for it because the payoff was so big. Like obviously I didn't have to go for it, but I felt like I had to go for it. Just because I messed up the turn before. Well, I didn't even mess up, did I? I just had bad dice the turn before. Which uh, made things... Made things trickier than they probably should have been. So there you go. There you go. And now, of course, he gets punched because of it. It is on the switch, yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's a good idea, Johnny. Just make it go for half the screen. <laughs> Hey. Okay. 
Well, we've got one hit on a character here. One bloody hit. Really game. I think I'll push him further forward. Alright. I think I've got a hit. Hit Ripper. Just because he's good. Gotta hit the ball. No. Hit Ripper because he's good. Happy New Year, Jimmy. Good luck this season. Ah, oh, thank you very much, Raw Rimbo. Thanks for staying fantastic. Ah, oh, yeah. Absolutely bloody glorious in it. Thank you very much. For over five Hool Beaver pregnancies. Incredible. It's a bug that it doesn't always show when they're KO'd. I don't know why. I don't know when it is, but it doesn't always show them being KO'd when they're KO'd. I didn't realise he was already KO'd. I would have just gone for the kill though, because he's going to score this turn, isn't he? He's got to score this turn, which leaves me four turns to score back with only one reroll, which isn't ideal. But could get a two-one win out of it. Tell me, there's a chance. Maybe I should have gone for the double, dodge double GFI on turn two. Or turn one it was, wasn't it? Ripper, Wizard, um, a Troll. <laughs> the Troll's an inducement. A Blitzer. <laughs> and a <uh>, Babe. <laughs> Congrats. Right, so put him, he's down to 11 now, though, I think. 3, 6, 9, 10, 11. He's down to 11 now. <sighs> yeah, that stupid bug's pretty annoying, to be honest. Yeah, but he's got a really good player, hasn't he? He's got a really good player. So if I was him, I wouldn't have even tried to win this game. Genuinely, I would have been like, it's a shame to waste 14 weeks of my life. <laughs> but I would have uh, given up any hope of not getting relegated if I was him. And bought apples and stuff and just tried to keep that guy alive. <laughs> and screw getting the playoffs or anything this season. And then just, you know, try to keep the team alive get relegated and then uh, and then rebuild next season if you're going to keep the team that is because that is a hell of a play I mean that is worth keeping keeping the team for potentially but like that's all he's got <laughs> yeah exactly yeah that's the thing I would have just I would have just given up on it well I probably wouldn't have done I think that's the best strategy I probably wouldn't have done. <laughs> Here's Johnny Vibe. He did there, but he did. He did actually do it there. Give up two dice in the ball, no problem. Yeah, exactly. Backyard Dodo. Yeah, I, a few people didn't. A few people didn't take a wizard last season. They took apples and stuff, which is, which is very. Uh, a very reasonable decision, in my opinion, and <laughs> not just because it's <laughs> not just because it makes it easier for me to win. 
I think it's genuinely a pretty, pretty big brain thing to do against this team is to, uh, is to you know focus more on surviving for some teams, especially in Rebel, like where the results of the games just don't matter that much, do they? You know, one game is unlikely to decide the season. Very unlikely to decide the season. So therefore. There's a good case to be made for just like not caring too much about this one in particular. <laughs> it's true though, isn't it? It's true. It's true that the result of one game is unlikely to decide the season. It's just a fact. The result, like the result of the, the whether it's a win or loss. Okay, Kale Rick, this is better. Whether one game is a win or a loss is unlikely to decide the season. Um, obviously, in the case of Chuck versus not Chuck versus Blabor, that's a fumble team. In the case of the Chuck Norris game um, versus Falcon Merck. That game did decide his season, but the, it wasn't the result that decided it. It was the getting everyone killed except for one player that decided it. <laughs> yeah, exactly, you don't, yeah. Oof. That's unlucky, all Huzzler. Yeah, that's what I was trying to say. Sure, but it's, um, it's unlikely that it's that specific one. That's what I mean. You know what I mean? I think it's a... If all of your opponents are Murder Chaos Nurgle, then you're up shit creek without a paddle, I'm afraid. That was a pretty annoying perfect defence. Uh, especially when I've only got four turns to score and it's a deep kick. He doesn't have kick or anything, that was just lucky, wasn't it? He? And he's managed to wall off the hits here pretty well. Got all of his strength on the same side as I want it to be. And stop me getting claw palm hits. Very annoying perfect defence. Maybe I should have put this claw guy there so that the perfect defence wouldn't have been, wouldn't have been as bad. Double skull, I've got to re-roll it, but I've got to see what happens. Right. Well, that was pathetic. <sighs> One, two, three, four, five, six. Is his Palmer still out? Yeah. This guy's ready to do something. He's got to come back to protect the ball. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, put him there. There's a dirty player here. And he could potentially do a huge gang foul. So I think he does the blitz rather than flat fart. Absolute shit. Mm. 
L'équipe se prend encore un pain. Enfin, comme on dit, pas de pain, pas de gain. Pour qu'elle ait la vision, j'entends. I think he wants to be here actually, doesn't he? Oh! <laughs> oh, rest the development. Yeah, it's funny, isn't it? The, the meme from some people in Rebel. I don't think it's indicative of Rebel as a whole, but there is certainly a vocal minority who are very much against multiple piling on and piling on on Warriors. Very true, Adon Adon. <laughs> hey, I still have multiple piling on on dwarves. Hey, Dev. <laughs> I still have four piling on on dwarves. <laughs> no problem for me to have some piling on on dwarves. Well, though not in Blood Bowls 2016, of course. <laughs> well, in that case, you just said, by the way, I only play Blood Bowl 2016. No, it's not as sweet as the, the chorf long beard. The chorf long beard? The chorf blocker noise is the best, isn't it? The, oh! <laughs> it's the, uh, the, the dwarf's crazy eyes, isn't it? No, it's, it, the, the dwarf one isn't as good. So he's going for the foul. Which might be a good thing. To be honest. Because that's like three players. At least three players over at that side, isn't it? <laughs> oh, Quackle Farker. <laughs> yep. Instant. <laughs> yeah, there's some people who have that attitude. <laughs> Show me. <laughs> there are literally people who have that attitude. Oh, wow. Interesting. This is. He hasn't gone for the foul. This is looking a lot better than going for the foul. This blitz is the best move because it frees up two players. But it needs a GFI. Which makes it pretty, pretty fucking horrible. And it's not hitting with Pong. And the fact that it needs a GFI means that a 1D is essentially the same as it anyway. I'll go for a handoff here and then a fuck off. A handoff and a fuck off. God, if I double score this, it's just a nightmare. Well, no guts, no glory. Good. 
Hey, cheeky cans. Please don't regen. Ah, you motherfucker. Look a dog. Look a dog. Randor 2D here first, I think. <laughs> Get off my fucking bitch, prick. <laughs> Sweet. Oh, he's at four. <laughs> With wrestle. <laughs> uh, my, my idea wasn't so good, was it? It was certainly kind of good. It wasn't so good. Yeah, he's edge two though. I'll pull the one anyway. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I guess I should have run him up like here. He should have run up to there. He's just gonna love it now, isn't he? He's just gonna fucking love it with this guy and this guy. Oh no. Oh no. This is pretty easy. Pretty easy touchdown, really. Yeah, we got rid of his wizard, but 2 0 down. <laughs> yeah, I should have gone up here, shouldn't I? Ugh, I wanted to get away from the Blitzer. I saw the Blitzer. I thought it's an easy free on the Blitzer. And then didn't see this character. That was disappointing, wasn't it? That was disappointing. Bad play. Punished. Rightly punished. Oh god, he's even eating his one disgusting behaviour. Getting rid of his one. Come on, be be son. No, it's not son. Oh god. Please fail. <laughs> Come on! Come on, four plus, same as my dodge. Yes! Glorious. Whew. <laughs> that was terrifying. All right, one, two, three, four, five, six, and then lob it to him. Or just not. Wait a minute. One, two, three, four, five, six, and then hand it off to him again. One, two, three, four, five, six, no. One, two, three, four, five, six, and then pass it. That's the best, isn't it? Because I could always just go double GFI the turn after. Happy off. New Year, you glorious beast hard. <laughs> glorious, thank you very much, Quackle Farker. Oh wow, that's that's there's the there's the extra three. Glorious. Right, he's gotta go there, hasn't he? Thank you very much, happy new year. <laughs> right, I wanna foul him at the end, I think. The extra arms don't help with the throwing, do they? I'm pretty sure. No, they don't. You can punch him at the end, it's not really important. This guy is kind of annoying. I could just do the GFIs. Do the GFIs and then foul. Yeah. 
Because the GFRs get me away from him. And I could foul him with no assists. Could just, I mean, the pass is unlikely to work. The two GFIs, I use the reroll. Yep. <laughs> Instant one. Irrelevant block, yes, please. Didn't get sent off outrageously. Reach him to hit. No, it's just this, just this guy dodging through. Ugh. Yeah, it's a bit scary. I mean, he's got a pretty easy hit, hasn't he? But that's why I wanted to break his armor, really. <laughs> what a foul. That's why I didn't really want to go for the the, the GFIs this turn. Because there's still a chance he pops it, and then I've got no reels for the last turn, isn't it? So maybe I should have stood there and had the plus one for the foul. It still wouldn't have broken as it happened. No, oh, come on, man. Yes, good. Yes! Yes! Right. Is there a 3D here? Looks like there is. <gasps> oh, 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 no, I can't reach. I can't, I can't, I can't do that one. Oh, as much as I'd love to do this hit, I can't do this one. I've got to do this one, I think. It's an, it's an extra player that could get removed. 3D is pretty safe. Oh, this could have been 2D on that guy. Wouldn't have broken his armor. Oh, Panning on has done fuck all this game. <laughs> He's done literally nothing so far. <laughs> Apart from put my guys on the ground sometimes. Oh yes, his bomb is still out. Is the bomber who killed himself on a greed reroll is still out? <laughs> right, so he's still on eleven. <laughs> Honestly, I think tense on everyone would be pretty good because it gives you it gives you like the only way to reliably stop one turners, isn't it? Is tense holding tense? You can stop one turn as pretty well. Um, so I wouldn't hit a bunch of tents. But the problem is the games where, <laughs> yeah, it worked out pretty well actually. In, in, in you know the fact that he failed those rolls, he could have easily been two 0 up, couldn't he, with better dice? To be fair, I think he used it, the wizard at the right time. I think he made all the right decisions. Just didn't get the dice to do on that on that turn. The turn that he needed the dice, he didn't get the dice. I don't think I should have. I, should, I definitely misplayed. I should have gone up the middle. Um, but to be fair, this guy did get pommed, claw pommed twice, I think, and survived. So, <laughs> so he was a bit lucky to have that guy there, but he did have him there, and I did miss position. Right, 
Okay, let's put him here in case of a, in case of a uh, perfect defense. All right, and he scores. He gets a level. That's pretty good. Now, who wants the uh, who wants the next level or the next SPPs? He could go towards legend. I guess he wants to go towards legend. Good old brainless chaos. Quick snap. All right. Man, another deep kick, but obviously plenty of time this this time. <laughs> That's true, J5, but you know, you got to try, haven't you? You've got to try to do the right thing. Sound effects amazing. Let's get a three D on here. Cheeky three D. My kicks <laughs> again, piling <bang> on. <laughs> What's going on? What is going on? This is bonkers. Glad he's out. He's pretty. He's pretty good on defense. Obviously, less good now that the uh, wizard's gone, but still pretty good. Could have moved him first, couldn't I? <laughs> How far can he go? <laughs> It's stupid how fast he is. <laughs> Ridiculous, really. <laughs> yeah, just fine. Yeah. Yeah, MK on himself was nice, wasn't it? MK, MK on himself was the was the biggest removal of the entire game, really, because while it was kind of a tough matchup for him team wise, he hasn't taken much, has he? Miss next on a Lino, badly hurt on a on a journeyman anyway, and uh, badly hurt on a Lino, so he hasn't taken anything. He hasn't taken anything bad. <laughs> the only bad, the only bad thing he's got was his KO that he did to himself. <laughs> yeah, pretty funny. Right. Okay, I think I should hit Ripper.
means I put both in here. One, two, three, four, five. So that means he goes there. He goes there. He goes there. He goes there. That's only two, isn't it? Did nothing. <laughs> uh -huh, so this, yeah, it doesn't come up anything, does it? It doesn't come up anything, but that is a KO. That's that's a super annoying. That's a super annoying bug. Super annoying. Right, one, two, three, four, five. Wait, where can you get to? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, that's right. So stay out of range of him. <laughs> It's, no, it's not though, it's the reverse Dr. Mon Bosco, because it sometimes makes you pile on, on a KO, and sometimes, sometimes, very occasionally, you don't want to pile on a KO. Very occasionally, mind you. <laughs> exactly, J5, that's next level thinking, isn't it? It's the fash fash offense. <laughs> fash offense of not doing any, uh, not making any moves. If you don't make any moves, you can't make the wrong move. It's the wise fash. One said. That was a nice chin. It was a nice chin to get to get rid of Ripper there. Well done, me. <laughs> Some people might not have seen that somewhere. Instant really stupid. <laughs> yeah, I forgot how long these turns are. <laughs> Thanks, Joss. <laughs> yeah, they are. They are long sometimes, aren't they? That's true. Oh no! He one dies pound Mr. Throw. That's what happens when you don't pile on, you get bloody one D pound. Fuck off. <laughs> Shush. Yeah, I know the pylon. <laughs> pylon did me no favours that turn. Geophyte upon him. 
<laughs> yeah, I'm gonna GFI Pom just because it seems like an absolutely terrible thing to do, but I mean, because it is. But on the other hand, you know, who cares? That goal is plus movement, minus movement, yeah, but I didn't want to sack him because he's strength four. Done. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, that's true, Volpies. That's a good point because I guess Dreamify is unlikely to win the division, so therefore keeping his good player alive is good for me. Yep. Yeah. But on the other hand, I mean, I don't like that. That that is his. That is his wild card for getting back into the game, isn't it? It's um, he hasn't got much chance of getting back into the game, obviously, with seven players. But if anything is going to give him a lifeline in this game, it is the movement eight edge four guy. So it wasn't it wasn't just for like I want to kill this player because he's a good player. It it was it was a match, it was a match decision rather than a rather than a league decision anyway. Yeah, that's a good point. I don't. Yeah, <laughs> that's a very good point. <laughs> that basically guarantees that he won't be cast. <laughs> uh oh. He's in the foul every turn mode now, which is going to be dangerous for the Warriors, isn't it? Very dangerous for the old Warriors now. Got to be on our guard. Stop the dirty orcs getting the fouls in. Dirty orcs. I just want to stand up. Stay there. I just need three assists off him, don't I? That's not too crazy. Mm, ball's vaguely safe as it is. Oh, yeah. Oh wow! He let me. He let me get away. That's fantastic. Oh, <laughs> fucking stun! <laughs> oh wow! I think I just go for the foul on him. Ugh. If I'd used both of them, I'd have broken AV as well. Jim Shard. The troll was a the troll was a was a was a merc troll, so he didn't even have to for sack him quite well for hacker. <laughs> it's just because he was down seven hundred and fifty TV or something ridiculous. So, but yeah, he hasn't he hasn't been a very he's been he's a horrible dice for the troll for sure. No, it was fair enough. He thought, you know, having a bunch of strength would make it harder to get broken down. Which is fair. 
it's a fair opinion to have. And obviously, if I'm hitting Ripper or the Trottle, then I'm not hitting his, his rostered players. So, I can see his point. <laughs> indeed, hit me, yes, indeed. Yeah, I think a guard troll might have been better if you're going to do that. I mean, he could have had Varag, I think. Or, uh, well, lots of things. Can... People do seem to love the chef, yeah. Um, mostly by performance. The new teams are all in one division together. And then... Um, it's mostly by performance. Yeah, I think double apple is what <laughs> is what I would have done. <laughs> yeah, double apple, double bird, yeah. <laughs> oh no, I didn't think of him. He's gonna foul as well. Oh no, he's not gonna get the chance. I knew I was going to fucking one in nine it. I knew this was going to happen. I don't know why I didn't put more men next to the ball. I, fu I didn't put these. I should have bracketed him first. I knew it was going to fucking happen. I literally knew it was going to happen as well. I, can't, I should have just taken the ball down and then punched him. Fuck me. That was such a horrible, horrible turn. Because I knew it was going to happen. I should have just bracketed this guy first. There wasn't really many safe moves I could have done. But I literally knew that was going to happen. Fuck me. <laughs> God damn it. Knew that was going to happen. I knew it. It always makes it bad, isn't it? And not only did I know it was going to happen... It was like the only thing that could cause me problems. There's absolutely zero excuse for not bracketing this, this time. Zero excuses. If you want to be part of Team Positive, then uh, you've got to fucking suck it up. Stop. He could have gone there. Uh, he could have gone in there. Try and fucking play better, eh? Or somewhere else. Yuck. Oh, and now he gets a 4 plus activation. <laughs> the troll just trolling me. <laughs> oh, well, my fault. If he'd been here, he'd have been in range for the hit as well, wouldn't he? <laughs> Stupid fucking dice. I'm not even going to win this game, am I? I didn't punt. Au bord du terrain, apportez des mains des fans qui ont l'air affamés.
just freeze it first for you, I guess. Scoring threat that can't be blitzed. The fucking skillless beast. <laughs> Every pile on does fucking nothing. But the skillless beast is just like, hello. <laughs> Fucking daft, isn't it? Blood Bowl. What a stupid, what a stupid shit game Blood Bowl is. <laughs> I guess he should have gone here, right? And then I could have 2D'd him. Would have been better. But I like I like that he couldn't stop me having a scoring threat. Like he totally couldn't stop me having a scoring threat, could he? Couldn't even base him. Well, no, I think he could have based him. Okay, he could have based him on the sideline. But then to do that, he'd leave him unmarked. So he pretty much couldn't stop me having a scoring threat by putting him there. That was the idea. Whether it was. Whether it was stupid or not is another question, but because given another given an assist here would have been nice. I'm sneezing my fucking guts out here. Oh. <laughs> That's pretty good. <laughs> oh no, he powered me. Is he blitzed yet? He could have uh, he could have pushed him, couldn't he? And then got a two D on the ball. Or a one D on the ball. <laughs> yeah, it's really fun. Oh, he's gonna do that and then chain him onto the ball. Oh, wow, that was really good. I really shouldn't have followed up last turn, should I? That was really good. Well done. Well done, Dreamify. Well played. <laughs> You've got to re roll because that's game ending. I've got a cold, yeah, just a normal, bog standard cold. Right, he's in scoring range. He's being tagged. He's being tagged. Uh, 
can't actually hit him. I've got to blitz him, haven't I? So that then he can then block him. <laughs> Why can't I be lucky? <laughs> Fuck me. <laughs> KO'd. Alright, good. Oh, no advice about the pickle over. I did forget that guy, but it's alright because uh, it didn't matter now, did it? Because he's up. Yeah, 2D anyway. Can't do anything anyway. But yeah, no, no, no advices, no advices, please. We're British. Fucking push. Of course it is. Good. Good, that's showed things up nicely. What a battle, what a battle this was. Fucking hell. He's got five players. I guess I got really careless against five, six, seven players, whatever he had. But fair play to Dreamify. He, he he stuck in, didn't he? He played he played very well. Made made some made some magic happen. And he's got off with it lightly as well, really, in terms of uh, perms. Yeah, it was really nice. That was really nice. His, his push play, yeah. Really nice. <laughs> but, you know, obviously it was my fault leaving it on, but it was still really good for him doing it. <laughs> no, maybe he won't. No, maybe he won't. I mean, he got the final of the, uh, of the playoffs, didn't he? So, like, obviously he knows how to play. That was never in doubt. It's just that his team is, <laughs> is pretty, pretty banged up. I mean, he could have easily won this two nil, couldn't he? If he got the, uh, if he got better dice on the wizard turn, he could have just won this two nil, or even three nil. <laughs> Yeah, that's the thing, isn't it? That's the thing, like, it's just dice, isn't it, really? Oh, get out of town. <laughs> well, this might still not be a win. <laughs> oh, for fuck's sake. I, I want to score on him as well, but it's a GFI. I don't know, GFI. I really don't know. Fucking Blood Bowl. Who'd play it? Oh, I can't score with this guy now. For fuck's sake. <laughs> No, maybe I can. Four, hello Goliath. Four, no, he hasn't got guard. <laughs> Panning on. Still yet to do anything. <laughs> Piling on hasn't it hasn't improved one bloody thing I don't think. Oh, has ever got a score on a bloody spath biscuit? <laughs> Doesn't make any difference, does it? Moving anyone else first. Je 
garantis pas que ce joueur soit encore debout au début du prochain tour. Si c'est le cas, tu viens. <rire> <laughs> Classic Jim. <sighs> Fucking hell, man. Imagine just rolling decent dice. Oh. <laughs> Played too well. <laughs> he played too well. There was no need to try this hard to win. <laughs> <laughs> fucking cunting. Ugh. Cunt of a fucking Man. shithead. Fucking cunt. Cunt. Fucking cunt. Cunt. Yeah, what was he doing? Cunt trying, beast. Should have just taken his apples <laughs> and stood in the corner. That his good players couldn't get blitzed. <laughs> That's not serious, in case you're stupid. <laughs> Views expressed in this stream are not supported by the legal I should have targeted him more. <laughs> But he had so many good players that I wanted to try and help. <laughs> God, what a terrible... That was a two points lost from my end, wasn't it? For sure. <laughs> um, damn. 27 AV breaks. That looks like it was a lot of AV breaks, but actually, it was just piling on, failing. <laughs> it was piling on, failing about 12 times. <laughs> Ugh. That was not a good day for piling on. It is three points for you, and I hate that, to be honest, in Blood Bowl. Unrelated to the fact that I've drawn. I hate that. Look at that, I made seven GFIs, that's bad, isn't it? Couldn't fucking catch it. Pickups were good. Too many pickups, though, I should let the ball get hit too many times. 37, 25, 35. It's actually not terrible dice despite all the double skulls. One, two, three, four. Four blocks re roll. That's quite a lot for me. And his greed one cost him the most, didn't he? He might have won if he hadn't greeded that. <laughs> if he hadn't greeted in a, in a double skulls into KO'd for the entire game. <laughs> 21, 15, 24. Kind of alright. Uh, really stupid. Well, it wasn't actually that terrible. The troll. It just seemed like it. The troll was actually pretty decent. Isn't that weird? And a huge pass fail. If he made that pass, he probably wins. Didn't he? So, and terrible GFIs, including double one runs. So he had some horrible dice as well. It's not like I was completely diced. Is it? He had some horrible dice. Um, at key points, and I had some horrible dice at key points. But, uh, well, not all of them. Not all of them hit me. I mean, the, the, the game does it like that, but, you know, if you're in a... If you're in a, if you're in a private league, you could you could choose to do something else, couldn't you? Um, a relegation, it, honestly, it's, it's, definitely, it's definitely doable for me. Just because l last season, honestly, was, was a ridiculous season. Like, it was... Um, yeah, fair enough. Like, Blood Bowl 2 does it like that. I don't know what he takes. He's a really shit ball carrier, just getting all normals. I really need to build a new ball carrier somehow. It was going to be the movement guy, but then he got minus movement. Um, but yeah, you know, it was... Um, oh, I was trying to think of something to say then. What was it? Yeah, like last season's 11-1-1 was ridiculous. You know, I had loads of good luck. I didn't have any bad luck, really, apart from the game that I lost. Whereas this one here with the one in nine and the the one in eighty one and stuff and those crucial those crucial really bad dice and his dodges and hit and everything like all those dice that happened that just didn't happen last year, last season. So they're gonna they're gonna happen this season, aren't they? Like you know, normally they happen that you you get some more bullshit than what I had to deal with last season. So I think a season like eleven one one is definitely not gonna happen. 
Um, so, so there you go. Right. Anyway, I don't know. I don't I've got a clue what he's going to take. Probably guard. Right. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, and stay fantastic.